Hello, this is DVKT Math, and in this video, I'm gonna show you. Oh, well, first, I gotta mention that in this video, you can notice that in this video, I'm doing it in a different format than the other videos. And well, first, because I don't really like typing the latex code and explaining the math stuff simultaneously in the same video in one video because that just takes too much time. And uh, well, I like this better because like I can annotate stuff on the PDF. So, yeah, it's more convenient, I guess, except for the fact that when I write it on the phone screen, the handwriting can be quite bad, but it's still readable, I hope. Anyway, so, uh, well, so in this video, I'm going to show you how to find the general solution for this equation. This equation is a Riccati differential equation. This equation is a Riccati differential equation. And the general form of a Riccati differential equation is this. Y prime is equal to P of X plus Q of X Y plus R of X Y squared. So basically it's a combination of, well, you know, the some constants or just one and Y and Y squared and the coefficients are some functions of X, some functions in terms of X. So um, this is the general form for a Riccati differential equation and the equation we're solving here. dy over dx equals y squared over x plus y over x plus x is a Riccati differential equation because we have y squared and y and well it's just x plus x at the end so yeah that's the p of x here. So, uh, yeah, that's a Riccati differential equation. And so for a Riccati differential equation like this, we can substitute u equals ry. All right, or we can substitute u equals ry. r here is simply the coefficient of the y squared terms. Well, I'm going to use a different color so that you can see it. All right, so we can substitute u equals r y, and r is simply the coefficient of the y squared terms. And then, well, applying the product rule of derivatives, I'm gonna change back to red because I like red better. Anyway, so uh, applying the product rule for derivatives, you can see that we can have well, it's just product rule anyway so u prime is equal to r prime y plus r y prime okay and then we have this expression for y prime we have y prime is equal to well instead of saying p of x i'm gonna omit the of x part and then i'm just gonna say p so y prime is equal to p plus q y plus r y prime all right and then we substitute that into here and we get r prime u prime is equal to r prime y plus r times y prime, which is p plus q y plus r y prime. And then after, well, I'm gonna erase erase this part first. After we distribute the r to each term, then well, we simplify using some you know just do some algebraic simplification just do some algebraic rearrangements and then we get this equation u prime is equal to rp plus r prime plus rq times everything in parentheses times y plus r squared y squared all right and then well we substituted u equals r y so we have y is y is equal to u over r i'm gonna write a better r all right u y is equal to u over r so we substitute that in then we get u prime is equal to well this the thing that i just underlined and then after simplifying it algebraically then uh, we have well i'm gonna erase this marks first well, I'm going to raise the ones above it too and uh, well so after doing some algebraic simplifications we get this u prime is equal to rp plus r prime over r plus q everything in parentheses times u plus u squared 
Alright, so this is the new equation that we have after doing the substitution u equals r y. Oops, this is the equation that we get after the substitution. So um, well, for our particular case here, for our equation one here, for this equation that we're solving, we have it's a Riccati differential equation with p x with uh, p of x equals x, q of x, which is the coefficient of y term, which is one over x, and r of x which is the coefficient of the y squared terms is also one of x, I mean one over x. So we will substitute u equals ry, which is equal to one over x. I'm gonna erase the marks above it so that it's clearer. Oops, eraser, all right. So, uh, well, we can substitute u equals ry, which is in this particular case equal to y over x. And that would give us well, u prime is equal to rp, right? And r here is 1 over x and p is x. So 1 over x times x, which is just 1. And uh, then, well, the coefficient of u is r prime over r plus q. So we get this. r is 1 over x. So r prime is negative 1 over x squared. And we have negative 1 over x squared divided by 1 over x, which means times x. And that's negative 1 over x. And we plus q, which is 1 over x, right here. So negative 1 over x plus 1 over x cancel out 0. And then we get plus u squared. All right, so we have u prime is equal to 1 plus u squared. And here I'm going to change to the next slide in a moment. All right, so I need to erase these marks first. Alright, so, uh, well, this is a separable equation. We have u prime is equal to 1 plus u squared, right? So du, du over dx is equal to 1 plus u squared. And, well, we can divide both sides by 1 plus u squared. And we get du over 1 plus u squared and multiply both sides by dx. And we have, we have a dx on the right-hand side here, alright? Then, uh, well, first I'm going to raise this first. And, uh, well, so that's a separable equation. And we can uh, integrate both sides here. And we get the inverse tangent, the arctan of u is equal to x plus c, where c is some arbitrary constant. So, u is equal to tangent of x plus c where c is some arbitrary constant and uh, so this is the general the general solution that we get for u and remember recall that we uh, substituted u is equal to y over x so y is equal to x times u all right so y is equal to x times u so yeah y is equal to x times u so the general solution for y is y is equal to x times the tangent of x plus c where c is some arbitrary constant. And that is the general solution to the Riccati differential equation. dy over dx is equal to y squared. Uh, I want to write it better. I'm just not so used to writing on the phone screen with my finger. y squared over x plus y over x plus x all right so this is the general solution and well thanks for watching and if you like my videos please subscribe to my youtube channel and please also follow my instagram math page with the same name dvkt math thank you for watching